Question number 11 is from magnetism where we have to deal with calculation of magnetic force. This is a current carrying conductor, a piece of current carrying conductor that is given, this length L, this is the circular part of radius R, circular part of radius R, respective angles given and this is also length L. If the arrangement is kept in uniform field B vector and F is the magnitude of the total force. So clearly the question is on a very easy note because if magnetic field is constant we know F vector would be I L cross B and now the options gives the options regarding the directions of B like when the B is along Z direction along X or along Y in this way. So let us say sequentially if B is along Z you could say that F would be I L is the total displacement and the total displacement is 2L plus 2R I cap cross the magnetic field is given along Z direction. So that would be B K cap and you could see that I cross K would be minus of J. So that is I 2L plus 2R into B into minus of J. Now clearly this claim is correct because the total force is directly proportional to L plus R and if this is correct this has to be incorrect because both deal with the direction of B along Z axis. If B is along X this also seems correct because if B is along X the cross product of I and I would be 0 so this is also correct and if B is along Y even this would be correct because in that case that would be B J cap I cross J would be K but the magnitude part would be same and we are interested only in the magnitude part so this is also correct. So for question number 11 the options are A, B and C. Now let us move to question number 12. 